आई एम धिनल पटेल असिस्टेंट प्रोफेसर एस एम जी कॉलेज ऑफ डेयरी साइंस आनंद आई एम वन ऑफ द कंटेंट राइटर फॉर पेपर नंबर थर्टीन दैट इज फूड एडिटिव इन दैट मॉड्यूल नंबर फाइव कलरिंग्स फॉर द फूड इंडस्ट्री सिंथेटिक कलर्स इन दिस मॉड्यूल वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द डिफरेंट सिंथेटिक कलर्स देर ए डी आईज एंड डिफरेंट एप्लीकेशन इन अ फूड सिस्टम कलर इज एन इम्पॉर्टेंट फीचर ऑफ फूड एंड कंज्यूमर्स ऑफन एसोसिएटेड इट विथ क्वालिटी टेस्ट एंड अ फ्लेवर कलर एंड वेर यूज फॉर सेंचुरीज टू इम्प्रूव द अपीरियंस ऑफ फूड्स कॉस्मेटिक्स एंड क्लोथिंग मोर देन एटी सिंथेटिक कलर एंड वेर अवेलेबल मोस्टली डिराइड फ्रॉम कोल्टार एंड पेट्रोलियम and somewhere used as a food additives without proper safety evaluations several reported health problems intoxication and even death were related to the consumption of foods containing synthetic colorants despite the new orientation towards the utilization of natural compound synthetic colorants are still used as a food additives the synthetic colorants are easy to produce they are stable less expensive and have a better coloring property than the natural one still synthetic colorants are considered to belong to a concern a category that requires the strictest safety evaluations the use of synthetic colorants is subjected to strict rules the synthetic colorants or a dyes are attractive to the food industry because they are superior to natural colorant in certain aspects like tinctorial power consistency of strength its range and brilliance of shade hue stability and its easiness of application the synthetic colors provide a large spectrum of colors they are also have a lower price and a greater availability now let's see some food colorant with the respective color sets like alora alora red ac that is yellowish red color amaranth that is red in color azorubin that is also known as a carmoisin that is red in color brilliant blue fcf that is greenish blue brilliant black that is black in color brown fk that is brown brown ht again a brown one the citrus red number 2 that is red in color erythrocin that is bluish pink color fast green fcf that produce bluish green color the fast red e that is red in color green as that is green indigo tin that is deep blue lithol rubin bk that is deep red color orange b produce orange color patent blue v that is blue in color poncio 4r and red 2g they are red in color quinoline that produce yellow color sunset yellow that is reddish yellow dye and a lake then tartrazine that is lemon yellow dye and a lake now we will discuss about the different synthetic colors with their adi and their utilization limit mentioned by the european as well as us countries as you know adi is acceptable daily intact and that is the amount of particular substance in a food that is to be taken every day for a lifetime without any appreciable health effects now let's discuss one by one synthetic food colorants and their use as a food additives on the basis of adi that is acceptable daily intake in this table we are going to discuss about the different synthetic color with their ADI provided by the JECFA that is Joint FAO or WHO Expert Committee on Food Additives 
and their utilization and limit in a foods according to European Union and US regulations. The first of all, Alura Red AC that has a ADI of 0 to 7 milligram of kg body weight and their specific use is in bitter soda, bitter wine, other non-alcoholic flavor drink alone or a combination with other colorant. Generally, it can be added about 100 milligram per liter. It can be also applicable in meat, breakfast, sausages with minimum cereal content of 6%. And the general uses include non-alcoholic flavor drink, candied fruits and vegetable, red fruit preserves, confectionaries, decoration and a coating, fine bakery wares, edible ices, flavored processed cheese, desserts, including a flavored milk products, sauces, seasonings, pickle, relishes, chutney, etc. It can also be added in mustard, fish products, pre-cooked products like surimi, fish roe, smoked fish, some extruded or expanded snakes, other snakes, edible cheese, rind, a complete formula for weight control and nutritional supplements, liquid food, supplement integrators, solid food supplement integrators, soup, meat and fish analogs based on the vegetable protein, other spirit beverages, fruit wine, cedar, perry, aromatized fruit, wines. According to FDA, it can be safely used generally for coloring foods including dietary supplements in amounts consistent with good manufacturing practices. And JECFA says 50 mg per kg limit in a milk and a 300 mg per kg in other food stuff. Next is Amaranth with ADI of 0 to 0.5 milligram per kg body weight. It can be used in a wines, spirit drinks including product with a less than 15% alcohol. It can be used in a combination with other colorants but not exceed 100 milligram per liter. It can be used in a fish roy. Generally the utilization limit is 30 milligram per kg. The next color is Azorubine that is also known as a carmoisin. It has an ADI of 0 to 4 mg per kg body weight. The specific use includes Americano, bitter wine. The general use include a non-alcoholic flavor drinks, candied fruits and vegetable, red fruit preserves, confectionaries, decoloring and coatings fine bakery wares, edible ices, flavored processed cheese, desserts include flavored milk products, some sausages, seasonings, pickle, chutneys, etc. Some fish and custardation pasties, pre-cooked crustaceans, salmon substitutes, surimi, fish roy, smoked fish, extruded or expanded snakes, some other snakes, edible cheese rind, complete formula for weight control nutritional supplement, liquid food supplement integrator, solid food supplement integrators, soup, meat and fish analog based on vegetable proteins, other spirit beverages, fruit wines, cedar, perry, the maximum level may not exceed amount mentioned for Alora Red. The next is Brilliant Blue FCF. It has an ADI of 0 to 10 mg per kg body weight. It can be utilized in a processed mussy and canned garden peas with a limit of 20 mg per kg and all foodstuffs and amounts mentioned for Alora Red, 
the general use of FDA includes it can be safely used generally for coloring foods including dietary supplements in amount consistent with GMP. The JECFA suggests the amount limit to 150 mg per kg in a fermented milk and 100 mg per kg in a baked goods. The another color is a brilliant black BN, ADI of 0 to 1 mg per kg body weight. It is used in all four stuff and amount mentioned like Alora red for general use. The another color is of brown FK. The ADI is not allocated, but it can be used in a Kuipers with a limit of 20 mg per kg. The next is brown HT, which is brown in color, has an ADI of 0 to 1.5 mg per kg body weight. It can be used in all food stuffs and amount mentioned for azorubin general use. The another color is citrus red number 2. It cannot be used, permitted only for coloring skins of the oranges, not intended for processing and the maximum concentration is up to 2 ppm of whole fruit. The next is erythrocin has a ADI of just 0 to 0.1 milligram per kg body weight. It can be utilized in a cocktail and a candied cherries up to 200 mg per kg. The cherries in a syrup and in a cocktail with a limit of 150 mg per kg. FDA suggests that it can be safely used generally for coloring foods include dietary supplements in amount consistent with the GMP. And JECFA suggests that it can be used up to 300 mg per kg in various foods. The next is a fast green FCF. It has ADI of 0 to 25 mg per kg body weight. FDA suggested it can be safely used generally for coloring foods including dietary supplements in amount consisted with GMP. And JECFA suggests that it can be used up to 100 mg per kg in a various food. The another color that is fast red color, the ADI is not allotted and it is generally not permitted in a food industry. Next slide. The next color is a green S. For green S, it is not allotted, but generally has a specific use in jam, jellies, marmalades, other similar fruit preparations include low caloric products. It can be used up to 100 mg per kg. It can be used in a processed mushy and canned garden peas up to 10 mg per kg and can be used in other foodstuffs in an amount mentioned for Alora red for general use. The next color is indigo tin. It has ADF of 0 to 5 mg per kg body weight. All food stuff and amount mentioned for Alora red general use. The FDA suggests that it can be safely used generally for the coloring foods or including dietary supplements in amount consisted with GMP. JECFA suggests that it can be used up to 300 mg per kg in various foods. The next color is lithol robine and for that no ADI is allotted but it can be utilized in edible cheese rind. The next color is orange B which is not listed for ADI. Approved only in US may be safely used only for coloring casing and surfaces of frankfurters and sausages not more than 150 ppm by weight of finished product. The next color is patent blue for that ADI is not allotted. But it can be utilized in all food stops and amount mentioned for Alora red general use. The next is Poncio 4R that can be also known as a 
cochineal red A. The ADI is generally 0 to 4 mg per kg body weight and the specific use include Americano, bitter and wine, jam jellies, marmalades, similar fruit preparations including low calorie products up to the limit of 100 mg per kg. It can be also used in certain sausages, sobreset and all food stuff and amount mentioned for azorubin general use. The next color is red 2G. The ADI is allotted to 0 to 0.1 mg per kg body weight. It can be utilized in a breakfast sausages with minimum cereal content of 6% and certain burger meat with minimum vegetable or cereal content of 4% and the limit is 20 mg per kg. The quinoline yellow which has an ADI of 0 to 10 mg per kg body weight and the specific use include Americano, bitter soda and wine, jams, jellies, marmalades, similar fruit preparations include low calorie products. It can be also utilized all foodstuffs and amount mentioned for Allora Red general use. The next color is Sunset Yellow FCF which has a ADI of 0 to 2.5 mg per kg body weight. The specific use includes in a bitter soda and a wine, jam jellies, marmalade, similar food preparations that includes low caloric product also. It can be used in all foodstuffs and amount mentioned for Allora rate general use. The FDA suggests that it can be safely used generally for coloring of the foods in amount consisted with the GMP and according to JCFA it can be used up to 300 mg per kg in a various foods. The next color is Tritrazine. It has an ADA of 0 to 7.5 mg per kg body weight. The specific use includes Americano, a bitter soda and a wine, the processed mussy and a canned garden peas and all foodstuffs and amount mentioned for Allora Red general use. The FDA suggests that it can be safely used for a coloring of foods in amount consisted with a GMP and JCFA suggests that it can be used up to 300 mg per kg in a various food stuff. Next is a synthetic color and health. The food color are being used in a beverages, desserts, jams, jellies, sausages, pickle, cosmetic, toothpaste and many products. In addition, medicines including tablets, capsules and syrups are dyed with some food colors also. The many of the food industries and other related companies as well as restaurants have relied on colorants in order to set their products. However, there is a question on a safety and a nature of a colorant which have been used for this purpose. The numerous study have demonstrated that the danger of artificial color in a food which include the possibility of onset attention deficit disorder, inhibition of immune system, hyperactivity and allergic reactions. In addition, the use of non-permitted colors or over injunction of permitted colors may also cause a thyroid tumors, urtic areas, dermatitis, asthma, nasal congestions, abdominal pain, nausea, eczema, liver and a kidney damage and also a cancer. The several food colorants have been banned in a developed countries due to their toxicity observed on experimental animals. Now this table indicates some of the routinely using food colorants and their possible effects. 
द किनोल इन येलो विच कैन बी यूज इन अ स्वीट्स एंड अ पिकल हैज एन इफेक्ट ऑफ अस्थमा हाइपर एक्टिविटी एंड अ रेसिस द पॉन्सियो फोर आर विच कैन बी जनरली यूज इन अ बिस्किट्स एंड ड्रिंक्स हैज एन इफेक्ट ऑफ एलर्जी एज वेल एज द इनटॉलरेंस द अलोरा रेड विच कैन बी जनरली यूज इन अ सॉफ्ट ड्रिंक्स सोन अ हाइपर सेंसिटिविटी द अजोरुबीन विच आर जनरली यूज इन अ स्वीट्स इट प्रोड्यूस द एलर्जी एज वेल एज द हाइपर रिएक्टिविटी द टाइट्राजीन विच कैन बी यूज इन अ स्वीट्स एज वेल एज द बिस्किट विच सोन अ अस्थमा हाइपर रिएक्टिविटी एंड अ रेसिस द सनसेट येलो जनरली यूज इन आइसक्रीम बिस्किट एंड स्वीट्स सो द गैस्ट्रिक प्रॉब्लम एज वेल एज द एलर्जी द एरिथ्रोसाइन विच इज जनरली यूज इन अ टूथपेस्ट एंड अ कप सिरप एंड इट सोज द हाइपर रिएक्टिविटी एंड एलर्जी नाउ लेट सी सम सिंथेटिक फूड कलरेंट्स एंड देर एप्लीकेशन एज अ फूड एडिटिव सजेस्टेड बाय द फूड सेफ्टी स्टैंडर्ड ऑथोरिटी ऑफ इंडिया अकॉर्डिंग टू एफ एस एस ए आई सर्टन सिंथेटिक कलर्स आर परमिटेड इन इंडिया एंड दे आर पॉन्शियो फोर आर कार्मोसिन एरिथ्रोसिन टाइट्रेजिन सनसेट येलो एफ सी एफ इंडिगो कैरमिन ब्रिलियंट ब्लू एफ सी एफ फास्ट ग्रीन एफ सी एफ एंड फॉर सर्टन एप्लीकेशन टिटेनियम डाइऑक्साइड इज ऑल्सो परमिटेड generally for a biscuits the limit is 100 ppm maximum for a powdered soft drink concentrate mix and a fruit beverage drink the synthetic colors about titanium dioxide is also permitted up to the level of 100 ppm except titanium dioxide the other synthetic colors are also permitted up to the level of 100 ppm and the application includes custard powder jelly crystals ice candy thread candies wafers certain flavor emulsions flavor paste that includes carbonated and non carbonated water only the carbonated food beverages or fruit drinks carbonated water soft drinks and a concentration that includes liquid as well as the powder for these food applications the limit is 100 ppm maximum the food applications like thermally processed fruits plum chiku guava strawberries raspberries lychee kanu custard apples pomegranate papaya and a fruit based beverage mix or a powder fruit based beverage that has a limit of 200 ppm maximum above this the applications like candied crystallized and a glazed fruit the sauces crusts fruit syrups sorbets cordial and a barley water a ginger cocktail cherry jam jellies fruit cheese fruit marmalades thermally processed vegetables that includes green beans wax beans green peas processed peas these applications has a limit of 200 ppm maximum and applications like fruit bar or a toffee a thermally processed food beverage or a fruit drinks or a ready to serve fruit beverages that has a limit of 100 ppm the applications like soup soup powders fruit powders vegetable powder instant fruit or vegetable chutney culinary powder seasoning mix powder filled chocolate sugar based sugar confectioneries chewing gums some bubble gums flavored and a fruit yogurt ice cream kulfi dried ice cream mix frozen desserts milk ices milk lollies and ice candies they have a 
synthetic color limit up to 100 ppm maximum from this titanium dioxide is allowed up to 10,000 ppm in a sugar based or a sugar free confectionaries as well as chewing gum and a bubble gum. So by this module we come to know the various synthetic colors used in a different food products with their possible effects with their limits in a food industry. As we know color is an important portion of any food stuff and synthetic color has provided a broad spectrum over a natural color to the food industry. But considering its harmless in a human body, we have to select the synthetic colors and subsequently which can be applied in a food industry. Thank you.